Hey there, welcome to the thrilling world of online trading in 2024. It's a big ocean out there with lots of fish, but don't worry, we're here to help you find the right strategy to reel in those big catches. Let's dive right in and make the sense of all these trading strategies that are floating around. First up, let's set the scene. Imagine a bustling marketplace. That is our trading world right now. Bigger, busier and more buzzing than ever before. People from all corners of the globe are setting up their virtual stalls and trying their hand at trading. And guess what? The number of strategies out there is insane. And as we all know, too many choices can make it tough to pick. So I'm here today to help you navigate through this without getting lost. But here's a heads up, hopping from one strategy to another, it's like trying every dish at the buffet, you might end up with a tummy ache instead of finding your favorite meal. So let's not waste any more time and talk about sticking with strategy long enough to see if it really works for you. We've all been there, right? Seeing everyone else apparently making a fortune and thinking, hey, I should be doing what they're doing. But remember, Constantly switching strategies is like restarting your favorite game from level 1 every few weeks. It might be tempting, but it will not get you to the final boss. Deciding to change your trading strategy is a bit like deciding to change your career path. It's a big move, you don't do it on a whim. It should come after careful thought and a good look in the mirror. Ask yourself, am I giving my strategy enough time? Am I playing by the rules? And if after an honest self-check, things still aren't clicking, it might be the time to swipe right on a new strategy. Changing your strategy is a bit like deciding to get a new phone. You don't need a new one just because your friend got the latest model. But if your old one isn't working well anymore, it might be the time for an upgrade. Same goes if your current strategy isn't making you money after giving it a fair shot. Or maybe it just doesn't suit your style and it's time to shop around. Now, let's talk about staying loyal to your current strategy. It's like having a trusty old car that's been with you through thick and thin. Sure, it has its quirks, but it gets you where you need to go. If your strategy has been delivering more treats than tricks over time, don't ditch it at the first sign of trouble. If your strategy has proven its worth over time, stick with it. Through the ups and downs, and constantly switching trading strategies is like planting a new garden every few weeks instead of watering and nurturing the seeds you've already sown. Sometimes you just need to be patient and give your plants time to grow and flourish. Finding new strategies nowadays is easier than finding a good movie on streaming services. Social media, online forums, trading books, there's a treasure trove out there. Just remember, not every shiny thing is gold. Test them out, tweak them, and make them on your own. So, you've decided to test a new strategy. Okay. Remember, testing a strategy is a lot like rehearsing for a big show. You wouldn't step on a stage without practicing first, right? Backtesting lets you rehearse in a simulated environment. Then, when you feel confident, you take the show live with a small account. So, do you need a new trading strategy in 2024? Maybe yes, maybe not. It's all about finding what works for you and sticking with it long enough to see results. Whether you're tweaking your old strategy or trying a new one, remember, patience, practice, and a bit of fun are your best tools in the game. Happy trading, everyone. And thank you for watching this video. That's going to be it from me for today. If you liked the video, don't forget to like it, share, and subscribe. And if you want to get in touch with us, the contacts page is in the description. My name is Ben Oliver. Thank you for watching, and have a great one.